Now, technical colleges in South Africa are in crisis. That's the word from students' body, SASCO. It says there are infrastructure backlogs and outdated curriculums. Now, SASCO is planning a day of action on Wednesday to highlight these problems. Our reporter, Kaya Litle Kumalo, is following this story for us. He joins us now live. So, Kaya, let's start with the basics. Why is SASCO concerned about the state of affairs at TVET colleges? Well, Shahan, they do have a litany of issues uh, that they've raised. They're talking about uh, long-standing problems in this sector. And you know that the TVET colleges in South Africa were really established to try and bridge the gaps in terms of the skills shortages. So they decry the problems facing this sector. They say they want to make sure that these colleges do become institutions of choice, not just disregarded by the Department of Higher Education and Training, but also then on Wednesday, they will have a demonstration across the country. Here in Gauteng, there will be a massive march that's going to culminate at the union buildings where they'll be submitting a memorandum of demands to President Cyril Mapos. So they're saying they're not going to the department, they're going straight to the president. So really to highlight uh, the crisis really facing these institutions, but also they're saying most young people that uh, do go through these institutions oftentimes do wait for their qualifications and some of the lecturers really are not well equipped. The institutions themselves really facing a number of challenges. Uh, and Shahan, we've got an opportunity to speak to uh, President uh, Matiwane. If we may just take a listen to him. There are people who are given a responsibility to be in charge of the sector from the government. <clears throat> The Minister of Negastolet. We are saying those people who are given that task are the ones who are not moving with the pace that we want. Which is why we are saying they must be given a leave because they've been given an opportunity for some time. They must be removed. We need new people. Those people, they must know that they have an agenda of dealing with our interests. Our interests are a priority now. We have been, TVET, we have been saying TVET must rise for many years. We are going to give the president 14 days to respond. Response from the Higher Education Department, Kaya? Well, a very underwhelming response uh, from the side of the department. Uh, suffice to say that uh, they are just still going through the demands of uh, the students, but also we know that in terms of the time frame, they have about 14 days to address all these problems. Otherwise, they'll go to the streets and intensify their program of action. All right, we're going to leave it right there. Kaya Kumalo.